Welcome, shall we observe the sun? Starting off today, with a sun diver I observed on the LASCOC3 filter, heading toward the sun on the 17th. I'll move in a bit closer for a better view. It disintegrates well before it reaches the sun. Now a look at the solar flare classification chart, showing the last three days of solar flares, observed on the 19th was an M-class flare, and today at 6 UTC an M5.51 class flare erupted at the 2 o'clock position on the sun. The green arrow shows the M-class level. On the LASCOC2 filter, the M-class flare is observed, also seen as solar particles, dancing around when the eruption occurs. Here is the eruption on the LASCOC2 and C3 filters. The M-class flare from today, observed using the C filters, looped twice. Shown on the CME chart, are five CMEs, that erupted from the same area of the sun today. On this CME model, the M-class, and C-class flares, that erupted close together on the 19th are mapped, as we observe the C-class flare, overtakes the Stereo B satellite, and the M-class flare heads in the direction of Mars, and the OSIRIS-REx satellite. On this HMI intensity gram map, five sunspot regions are on the Earth-facing side of the Sun today. On this thermatic map, different features of the Sun are highlighted. Such as the dark blue areas are the quiet areas on the Sun. Green areas are the coronal holes. And light orange are the prominence. Thanks for watching. And as always, sit back, relax, and let me keep my eye on the Sun for you.